Good afternoon, everybody. Steve Fletcher with the Trumpet for My People. Today's April 21st, 2022. And I got to share this piece of information with you guys that was sent to me uh, through a comment on my Facebook page. And uh, so I shared this, uh, this link, okay, my most recent video. And then I got a comment here from a friend on Facebook who says this, Steve, I'm getting a sign of something you are saying is in alignment to what Jesus is doing right now. The next few picks are my surrounding. Maybe they mean something to you. And I started looking at all of the pictures she sent to me and every last one of them just seems really, really amazing. Okay, really, really amazing. The first picture she sent to me was her uh, GPS tracker or the maps uh, application she's using. And she's about to turn on to Fletcher Street. And she's on her way to Goshen, New York. Okay, so she's following a map. She's following, she's going to turn left on Fletcher Street and she's going to arrive at Goshen okay now the uh, let's take a look here this picture right. welcome to the village of Goshen New York alright so let's take a look at Goshen in the Bible now Goshen was the place that Israel was protected and where they remained until they left Egypt and went into the promised land. The Israelites lived in the land of Goshen and they were protected in Goshen. They were there in Goshen. Okay. And they remained there you can study this, study the word Goshen, and you will see. The land of Egypt is before you. Settle your father and your brothers in the best part of the land. Let them live in Goshen. Okay. If you know of any among them with special ability, put them in charge of my own livestock. Okay. So the Israelites lived in Goshen, and they were protected there and cared for there until they went into um the promised land okay here's Genesis 50 and then in Exodus 8 it starts talking about the uh, plagues that are coming upon uh, Egypt and on that day I will do differently with the land of Goshen where my people live no swarms of flies will be there so that you will know that I the Lord am in this land okay and then when they left Goshen it was from Goshen that they went into the promised land okay so they were still living in Goshen up to the time of the plagues uh, of uh, Egypt, okay? All right, so we're looking at this, uh, that picture. Now, I just saw this. I got to add this in here because I had not seen this. The first time I went through this, uh, I did not see this, but Maplewood, welcome to the village of Goshen, New York, Maplewood, 1815. Oh my gosh. As soon as I saw this number, I, I hadn't, I didn't see it the first time through. 1815. Now we've been looking at uh, all of these um, connections to 1815. Let me uh, pull up here from my YouTube channel and show you what we've been looking at over the last couple days and how 1815 has been a huge number we've been watching. Okay, it started here a couple days days ago when we, we started talking about the boom, the boom uh, drop, the Invictus Games, and it's connected to the uh, the clock. Okay, the clock and the date on the phone of Prince Harry when he got the call from Michelle and Barack Obama in 1815. Okay. Okay. So anyway, we did we did two two videos. Uh, specifically about this okay the boom drop and then we have all of these connections I did in this video it's called 1815 Wednesday 27 April all right 
Well, now we got this photo that's being sent to me about Goshen, New York, the place where uh, all of the Israelites were protected while they were in Egypt, where they were until they went into the Promised Land. And then we have the, another connection to the number 1815. What do you guys think about that? And then uh, this picture she showed is a football field. The first thing that's, that I saw there was a goal post. Okay, so we're reaching the goal post. We're coming into the goal posts. There's a plane above, and so we're ready to fly away. Okay, we're reaching our goal. We're reaching our the end of our road here. We're going to be turning on Fletcher Street going into Goshen, and we're going to be protected there until... We go into the promised land where we are getting ready to fly away. And then the other thing here that came out was 17 West. 17 is the number of victory, okay? Victory. Okay, so what do you guys think about all of this? Isn't that pretty interesting here? Steve, I'm getting a sign of something you were saying is in, in alignment to what Jesus is doing right now. The next few picks are my surrounding. Maybe they mean something to you. Let me know what you guys think about all of the signs and the different numbers that appear in these in these pictures and anything else you're seeing in the pictures that I did not see. But as soon as I saw Fletcher Street and Goshen, I'm like, whoa, this is amazing. And I just want to thank Sister Shyla and for sending me this information. And I pray it's all a, ble a blessing to all of you. Have a wonderful afternoon. This is Steve Fletcher with a trumpet for my people. The sign of his coming revealed.